Yeah. It's about time. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Today we are back with the second episode episode of Ostrov. Um, last time we left off whilst building the uh, windmill, we've got three farms set up. Well, three fields, anyways. Um, and we are trying to get some migrants in. Uh, we are also currently running in a deficit uh, in terms of cash, but that is okay because we do have the town hall set up to be built. Uh, furthermore, we've got the carpenter built and uh, the smithy, which is very important in terms of uh, repairing our carts. So once that's done, we'll get another house built, cart parking, then I think we'll build our town hall, then the warehouse, Maybe we should put that there. And we could put the orchid. We'll put this over here because this is very quick. Um, so these are all quick things, this is fine. And then we'll place some houses. So we won't have row houses just yet. We could potentially start placing just some freestanding houses. But I am thinking that we might want to increase the size of this. We might place a couple houses over here. So if we quickly grab a village house. So it's an uneven terrain. Uneven, uneven, uneven. So you could fit so many houses within that area. But I guess for now, we'll just place... No, hang on. This doesn't. That doesn't seem, seem like a smart idea. So we're going to place... Some houses with some gardens, like so. Just making sure it's recording. Cool. Okay, doesn't look like we're gonna get a house there for uneven terrain. Um, we'll pop a house there as well. So then, in that case, we will put two houses over here. So we'll put a house before and a house after unpause that and then we'll build it within that order. We should also probably start looking at the brickworks from clay, sand, water and charcoal. Cool, so we'll get the this, so that's over there. No, that's the trading post. There's that. Okay, so we will want to place this See, we can't place here because this is where we want row houses. This would be bad for the people. So, potentially, we will place it over here and then, like, have the row houses go along here. Maybe that. Maybe that's best. Uh, so, if we grab our brickworks and we place it here, that should be fine. And then we'll just speed up time just because it makes the game life well it just makes it easier and more things get done and then we can have shorter videos so they are all going to be having some nice variety of food uh, which means we can probably stop buying that peas because there's no need to buy peas as there's it's expensive and it's they will have food, so it's fine. Uh, in terms of what we can store here, we'll probably have cherry trees, but apples makes more sense. Um, okay, we'll wait on that for now. But harvest season is upon us. So they didn't grow fully, neither did they, but it's okay. So these are potatoes, I believe. Yeah, potatoes. And then we've got wheat. Aha, the windmill has been built, which means we can hire a worker. Labourers, we won't hire them. Um, we'll drop that down to 60, we'll drop this down to 30. Fantastic. And then we can hopefully start um, getting in some workers. Uh, so we want to start turning that into wheat as soon as possible, so for the time being we will cut down on one of our builders to get him to work in the windmill. Now, this is going to allow us to get wheat, 
which means we can now swap our peas. Well, we'll wait for the peas to sell out, and then we'll swap it out for flour. So we've got this over here. They're storing their potatoes. We'll do 1,500 because it appears that they have reached their max. So we are going to... Um, the potatoes do still rot in the um, granary, which is not amazing because it means we are going to have we are going to run out of a lot of f not run out we're going to get rid of a lot of food uh, and waste it because of we can't meet the demand of eating um, but that's fine so they but they've just moved in I believe so that's why they're poor because everybody else is rather rich so that's fine. Um, after that, there will be the sand pit, platform, car parking, big hay. Cool. So everything seems to be set into motion to be built, and it will be. Uh, it will all work out. So we are making our first batch of flour. How much? Seven hundred units of flour, of wheat. Sorry. So we can drop this to a thousand for now. Oh, no. A thousand. There you go. Um, so they're making flour out of he over here. Which is all nice, all good. That's going well. Building's going well. In terms of further expansion, so we have our small little village over here. Now, this is looking like we're going to make turn this into an industrial area but if we put a bridge across and make this part over here into an industrial area and then this part into residential that might be beneficial along with branching out over here making some more residential some farms over here might be good in the future for now this will be like our little farmy area that's why we're getting rid of the trees over here uh, with the orchid so no jobs available, no housing available, so we will increase... See, the problem is, once we okay, once we build more houses, we'll get the jobs coming in, because at the moment it would just be... It would be taking away from the uh, job force, the workforce, sorry, um, if we moved it now, because then it would just be spread too thin, um, and that won't work for us. So these are going nicely. So we've got... Um, uh, 1,200 units of hay, um, which will be good for when we start trading for animals. So that's all going well, well and swell. And then the house is being built. I do like the uh, way that the houses get built. It's like piece by piece. So we can see like we've got a bedroom, uh, some sort of kitchen, toilet maybe, and then like the living room of some sorts. Uh, so they're making more flour, I mean uh, wheat, so we've got 80 flour so far. Uh, the peas, there are still peas unfortunately, so we can't quite turn over into the... Um, Lord, we do have a lot of potatoes. Um, yeah, not too many more potatoes there. Um, so that's now on wheat, that will start growing wheat, that's on fallow, and this is on buckwheat, so that's fine. That should work quite well. That's still making some more flour. Oh, so flour also apparently goes off, which is less fun. So I'm thinking if we... Huh. What do we do? What do we do? I'm also thinking these will be like the last houses we build with farms, just because then we can force them to buy more food and get us more money, which is great for us. So if we get rid of peas, because it's already there, so if we get rid of the peas and we add flour instead, it should, yeah, so it still stays there, which is good. But now they're going to bring over the flour from the granary and put the flour in there. 
and then people can start buying flour and that will be uh, then they can start making bread and stuff once we give them milk as we can see there's already 20 flour that's getting used up uh, the next house will be done very shortly and then we will add to the workforce uh, probably don't need a smithy don't need a carpenter um, the forest stream kind of makes more sense than anything or we can just save like mm, yeah it all really depends because we'll eventually need them for the warehouse but that would be woman trading post see yeah, we'll we'll see. We could probably add it to the builder just to speed building along, which actually probably makes a lot more sense. So let's have a look see at people's health just to I love her eyes shining with black thorn drenched in rain. Interesting, interesting. Health is looking good overall. Um which is fantastic. So we'll again increase the speed to times twelve. There we go, another village house is completed, so we'll add a thing to the job, to, so we can have jobs available. Sand pit is also now built, which is fabulous. So now they're going to build the platform, which means we can now turn this off for production, and turn this off for production. So... Wealth distribution, we have mostly middle class apparently, it would appear, which is pretty good I'd say, which means a lot of more tax. We want the smallest upper class we can get, just because that means, I mean, well no, we want the largest uh, first, like, upper class, however we want to put that tax, like, we want to make that super taxi, uh, to just to make it easier. So we'll order two carts from there and we will move this cart here, move this cart there and destroy this cart. It is being used. Okay, that's fine. Once it's done, we will destroy it and then we'll destroy that building over there. Um, so it's still being used, which means it is that one or not. Where is this cart? It is over here. Okay, interesting. So, they, we now have the uh, cart ordered. Relocating, ordered, ordered. Drag and drop from another. Okay, so we've got one cart in here so far. So, all of that's taken up. We'll demolish this building. Oh, these labourers are still paid a lot. So we want to destroy that, but we can't. We need to relocate all of those first, which is a problem. Okay, so we've got our uh, new workers, which is fantastic. Looking for job, four women, one man. Men. Okay, so we will want to put that man to work. Not no, we might just put him into building. Potentially, yeah, that looks that that seems like it will work. And then we'll just keep the woman uh for now. So we'll wait for that car to be repaired, I guess. So lovely that's been um built, which means we'll now start storing hay, waiting for when we get the uh waiting for when we get animals um so all carts need repairs yes i'm aware cart needs repair but they are currently building the next uh set of carts so now they're building the town hall which is fantastic because that means we can get rid of the camp center which is good 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 We'll look at this house to see who has who's arrived. Um, they have quite a few children, which is fantastic. Oh, we have our first death, which means we are going to want a burial plot over 
We'll place the burials. I'm trying to think. Somewhere that people can easily access. Because it is a new part of the update that they'll visit their deceased family members. So if those are houses there, we'll probably put them... We'll probably just put it here, just because why not. So we'll get a couple burials, burial spots, just in case. So we've got the grave of that person. So they worked in the forestry, which now means that the forestry is a person down, which means we are going to have to get rid of a builder, which will now move to the forestry, which is completely fine. So as you can see there, this person here. Yeah. She visited her uh, grandfather, maybe. Uh, so she started working at the farm. That's an important member in her, important moment in her life. So she is going to make her way back to her house. Uh, she doesn't know what to say. I mean, I don't blame her considering her grandfather just died. She's also probably going to start dying soon. Unfortunately, it's but it's uh, what's going to happen. If we also want to quickly add a, um, not a sheep farm, a where be it, where be it, uh, where did it go? Not a farm, not a windmill, cow shed. Uh, a cow shed, so we can start doing dairy. So our farm's over here, so we'll take a cow shed and we'll place a cow shed over here. Uh, control to rotate slower. Cool. We'll place a cow shed over there. Uh, one second. Okay, right, so <clears throat> we have to. What do we have to do? We are building our town hall, village house. And then the warehouse. Okay, cool. So we'll get that to go along nicely. Um, what's this one? Buckwheat. Fallow. Wheat. Cool. We've got enough potatoes. Can't find any nails. Well then, we'll just have to hire another smitha, smitha won't we? We will have to indeed make some more nails fantastic stuff um that looks good realistically we should have two more houses in there so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna take normal village houses and we'll place them this will be our market so we'll place a couple houses where will we have this neighbourhood? This neighbourhood will sit over... We'll put this neighbourhood over here. In hopes that... So we'll do it like this actually. We'll do it four at a time. Not uh, four at a time, uh, like rows like that. So we'll have four houses over there, but we'll put all of these, we'll pause these two, put this one in between there, and then this one in between there. Uh, which should be fine. Or I say should because you never know. <laughs> but um, then I think what we want to do. Unfortunately, they passed away just last year. But we are going to want a barber's surgery, but we can't do that just yet. So we'll take a primary school and we'll put the primary school. Where are we going to place our primary school? Could have a primary school somewhere over here. Potentially. Oh. Oh there so we could place our primary school there which isn't a bad place so we'll place it there for now 
We will pause it, however. Uh, we are needing those nails. Not enough charcoal. Burning completed. Okay, so we will add another charcoal pile. Like so. Oh. And... That's it. Cool. So we'll get everybody to start moving the charcoal along, um, which will help along with uh, the nails, which then we can then get the town hall, which is everything we need. Uh, in terms of firewood, we are perfect on firewood, so that's good, that's good. Uh, sales, sales are going well, our potatoes are going to go out of stock though, which isn't fantastic. I do wonder what happens when that happens, but we will find out, I guess. Maybe it minuses 10, maybe the whole thing. I'm not sure. Not sure. Now, this... Okay, so everything is kind of set behind because they don't have enough charcoal. Once this starts burning, everything will be fine again. I'm not sure what happened there, but that's fine, I guess. We could realistically, once this forest gets cleared, add another... See, the problem is these trees are so far away. And so we will, we will unmark these trees for now, actually. Just because we want to clear out that forest as soon as possible. So we'll unmark those trees, and so now they have to come down here to work, which is inefficient but necessary for the greater good of the f village. Making some more uh, f uh, flour. Flour seems to be selling quite well. Ten potatoes have been bought, all have gone throt. I think they're going throt now. There's that tiny little sliver. It's still there. But I'm not sure in terms of potatoes going off. I do feel like that mechanic is going to get very annoying very quickly. But it's okay. We just need. Now we're just really needing those uh, nails, which is perfect because we've got charcoal now, so we can now start producing uh, more pieces of. Uh, Ironworks, which is fantastic. Cool. So now that that's happened, they should start. Yep, yeah, there you go, making nails. They are making 10 nails at the moment, which is fine for now. They are planting the next season of wheat. That's fallow. That's buckwheat, which will get planted in a minute. Sowing is nearly complete. They are now working on that. Fantastic, that's been sowed, that's being sowed. And then we'll get potatoes next, wheat next, buckwheat next. So next year we're going to have a full harvest of all of the different uh, crops which is fantastic uh, I just wanted to have a look see what other things we can grow we can grow hemp but I'm pretty sure there's a building for that so we won't worry about that uh, if we go under production hop yard okay so that means hops not hemp yeah, but it's close enough for now all is well if so they're now building this again, can't find nails. Well, nails are being produced, so that's fine. Uh, after that's done, a village house, then warehouse, then village house, then trading post, then village house, then orchid, then village house, then brickworks. Uh, we don't need bricks as of just yet, so that's fine. Um... So they're making flour. They're doing everything they can. So I wonder if these peas just sit here indefinitely. I'm not sure. 
Not sure at all. Somebody had pumpkins. They had pumpkins. Nice. Uh, the this person is the mayor. Th this person. They don't have that much variety of food, but that's fine, I guess. They say hello. So he is the mayor. Hello, Mr. Mayor. And for some reason, this house is already getting materials, which is fine, I guess. We are just waiting for this to be built, and I would like it to be built quite quickly. This is still needing repair. They are still waiting on metal parts, though, so... That's a bit of a problem. We could... We do need this to start burning some more. Burning completed. So there's charcoal here, but nobody seems to be taking it. Not too sure why, but it should be fine. Okay, so we now got the town hall built. We don't need a councillor, we don't need a mayor. Well, we should have a mayor. Yeah. Our mayor's over there. So I'm not sure as to why the camp center is still here. That's fine though, I guess. Uh, so builders will get paid, they'll get paid 70. Councillors, well, we don't have a councillor yet, so that's fine. Treasury, okay, so now village house rent. Housing rent will be 60. Land tax will be quite high. 65. Okay, so wealth tax will be 50 and it will be starting from 80 and above. Taverns tax, that's fine, that's fine. Market products price. Basic monthly wage. Labourer's wage will be dropped. So I am still confused within local purchases, purchase from citizens, if that is uh, my purchase, purchase, purchases, or if they were to purchase. I'm not too sure. Uh, we'll actually make it 90, and then increase it like that. So now if we look, so we'll let that run for a second, everybody should still, monthly income, monthly tax, good, monthly income, monthly tax, good, monthly income, monthly tax, good. And that's just land tax as well. These guys are killing it in terms of cash. But they will also get uh, punished with the wealth tax. They're still good. They're good. They're good. They're good. They're good. And they're good. So we can actually increase that land tax. We'll also increase apartment tax and the village house rent will also go up. So now let's have a quick look. They're good. 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 Okay, so it doesn't appear that most people will be fine. I'm not sure how that will work though in with okay, so I just have to unpause. Um considering the fact that uh with all the other taxes because that just shows land tax but it will we'll see so income should now start going up we might drop that just a tad um okay charcoal nice Population. So population is well within the 100 plus. We do have quite a four, few people in poverty. Um, then lower middle class, upper, mi upper middle class, and then upper class. Oh well, it should be fine. So this is the fellow field, this is the wheat, this is the buckwheat. Wheat. Some nice wheat. Wheat. But, um, okay. So, seems to be going fine. So, we're nearly in the middle of the year again. Okay, cool. They are getting more of that. Um, anything rotting in here yet? No. 
they have less than one wheat, but still wheat. That's confusing, but fine. So, is that meant to have missing panels? Oh, I'm sure it's fine. So, what's being built next? The where village warehouse, uh, the village house, then warehouse, then house, then trading post. Okay, cool. So that's all going along nicely. Um, but I think for episode two, we'll leave it there. We got the town hall complete, so that's nice. Um, thank you guys for watching. Um, Terraria playthrough should be coming out soon, if it's not already out. I, 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 I'm recording these all very close together, so I'm not sure on the upload schedule just yet. But it should be out fairly soon. So uh, I hope you do go check that out and leave this video a like. And check out uh, a channel that I did um, the Terraria playthrough with. I'm not sure if they want me to link it just yet. So I will let you guys know about that. But for now, uh, thank you for watching. And I hope to see you again soon.